In this video, I am going to share with you a very cool guide to build a mixture of expert model using PyTorch from scratch by Avinash Suri. I just stumbled upon his GitHub repo and it's simply fascinating. From this Git GitHub repo, you can jump to the Colab where he very generously and graciously shares a step-by-step -step process to build a mixture of expert model from scratch. We all know that with the release of Mixtrol and then various other mixture of experts model, these days there is a lot of talk around these sort of models. Even Llama 3, which is an upcoming sensation, is possibly built using this architecture where multiple mixture of experts models have been used. Now, in sparse MOE or mixture of expert models, much of components are shared with the traditional transformers. And there is also some evidence which points to the fact that training stability is one of the main issues with these models. But Avinash has done some wonderful work in this GitHub repo and then in the code where he has tried to cater for these issues. In this implementation, what he has done is he has taken inspiration from Andre's work and then he has built upon it. He calls it make more architecture, uh, sorry, make more architecture, make more is uh, from Andre. And what he has done is that he has used sparse mixture of experts instead of solitary feed forward neural net. And then he has also used top K gating and noisy top K gating implementations. Plus, he has uh, used gaming key initialization, but in this notebook, you can also change it. So you can swap in Xavier Glorot initialization and take it from there. Okay. The things which he has used from Andrej are the data set, tokenization, and also language modeling. Also, he has used the same causal self-attention implementation, training loop, and inference logic. Okay. Now, if you look at this diagram which he has shared here, it is quite simple. In this, there are some experts using router and then producing the weighted output. And if you look at this code step by step, and I'm not going to describe in detail because he has done some fabulous work here with the comments, and but I'll drop the link in video description. So if you look at it, what is happening, he's installing some of the prerequisites here, torch and all that stuff then it is he is using the same shakespeare data set used by andrej and then it is using the character checking what sort of data set it is and then still some data manipulation is happening and then he is using um, torch and coding on the same data set and fr from there it is chunking it splitting the data into train and validation set and this goes on and on. These are some of the batch sizes. And of course, you can change it if you like. And then it goes on and on. And now, from here, that uh, it is using the auto-regressive nature of prediction. And then also, how the context is rolling a Windows over one-dimensional arrangement. Now, here again, he is using some of the borrowed code from Andres Karpathis. And now you can see that here um, he is using some of the masking technique, some of the attention. And um, this masking technique is crucial as it obscures any information following the current token's position, thereby directing the model's attention to only the preceding part of sequence. And such an attention mechanism is also known as causal self-attention. So, but Note that the sparse mixture of expert model isn't restricted to decoder-only transformer architecture. And then he discusses some of the other work. And then he, here he is just using that causal thing which I just mentioned and multi-headed self-attention. And from here, he starts with the actual creation of the expert model. And he has defined a function which is simple, a linear layer. And then from here, he is using top k getting and then he is building upon it, just using the softmax function and then generalizing and modularizing the code with the forward and init functions of top k router. 
and then there is a lot of other code which goes on and on and i will leave the link so that you can read further but the fact of the method remains that it is not hard that just within few months it has become so um, plausible and easy to build your own model especially mixture of export model from scratch of course you would need a beefy system for it but still um, i think there are a lot of things even if you want to ex extend this research you could do you could make it more efficient for example you could um, do some more enhancement and optimization in terms of sparse activation of the correct experts you can try out different neural net initialization strategies you can go from character level to sub word tokenization or you could do bayesian hyperparameter search for the number of expert so that's it guys i hope that you like that hacking session from um avinash really hats off to him i mean i'm very very impressed with what he has done he also has written a good blog post on hugging quiz which i just came across and i would highly suggest that you go through it too if you are looking to build your own mixture of expert model so thanks for watching i hope that you like the content if you did please consider subscribing to the channel and if you're already subscribed please share it among your network thanks for watching